Hello guys, welcome to my 21st video tutorial on XHTML and CSS. And finally guys, we're going to talk about the property app uh, position. Okay? So there's uh, three types of position. It's absolute, relative, and fixed. Okay? So let's go to the portal and open page1.html. And you can delete all the code from the previous video tutorial. Okay? And in this video, uh, we are not going to use the CSS external file. So you can delete the line of code you have uh, saying uh, link, rel, blah, 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 blah. You can delete that and you can type the style text, okay? Because we're going to use the CSS uh, code here, okay? And the uh, page1.html file. So let's go to the body section and type three divs. Okay. Three different divs. Because I'm going to show you guys <coughs> how to use uh, the property um, position in one of them. But let's uh, type these three. Let's put John and Victor would be James. Victor would be uh, the the div that we're gonna give some uh, properties. So let's give it an ID name of Victor as well. So now we have to type div. I mean ID. Uh, Victor curly braces and let's give it a border border of 2 pixel solid black or let's give it a blue color save this run this in Chrome and there it is, okay. Let's change the width. Width will be 50 pixel and height is okay. Let's see now how this is. Okay, um, we have now the div that we want with a nice blue border okay and now I want to place this div uh, this div uh, around here okay so we're gonna change the position of the div in our website or web page so let's start by giving the position attribute absolute and then let's type top uh, top compose 100 pixel and then left 300 pixel save this and refresh and something oh okay I forgot to put the semicolon here refresh this and there it is okay so now we have an absolute position okay in the web page of the div of top a hundred pixels from top okay the top is here where the page starts top hundred pixels this is hundred pixels and three hundred from left okay so this is an absolute position of a div, okay? Now, what about if we change this to relative? Refresh. Okay, what happened? Relative, you notice that um, we changed to relative and 
James came down, okay, and uh, this is where Victor should be, okay. So we have um, a blank space in where Victor should be uh, originally. So if we go to the the body, we type a div John, a div Victor, and then a div James, okay, in that order, and so John is here, Victor is virtually here, okay, or should be here, and then James is the third here. But why does not Victor, uh, Victor is not here, okay, that div is not here, is in blank, and it's here, because we gave it uh, some coordinates, okay, we gave coordinates top 100 pixels and left 300 pixels. So the top 100 pixels now is from uh, from the original position, not from top. Okay, the top 100 pixels, this top here, we type relative, and now the top 100 pixels is relative to his. Uh, original position in the body section, okay, or in our web page, which is here, okay, a hundred from this top here, and three hundred from this top, from this left here, okay. So you now know that relative, when we type relative position, is relative to his position in the body or in the website, okay, in the web page. Okay, um, and absolute is the absolute position to from relative to the whole uh, web page. Okay, so don't worry, guys. If you don't, if you didn't understand this, just uh, send me a message, and I'll try to uh, explain you better this this thing of um, position relative and position absolute, but just if you type uh, or try different um, examples you will uh, you'll get the the, the idea okay um, let's now use the other uh, uh, position type which is fix it okay you can delete this left and let's type five pixels refresh and to see this work we have to type uh, some paragraphs here go 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 P okay copy this and let's paste some some of this below Okay. Just uh, type some a few, um, copy paste a few because we have to scroll down the page. Okay. Now refresh. Okay. We now can scroll. We have enough to scroll down the page. So now th this is where Victor is. Victor div. Okay. And you see we um, we have the pos position fixed and then position from top 5 pixels. Okay, so we now have the div vector 5 pixels from top. Okay. And when we scroll down, you see it doesn't move, okay? And it's uh, always um uh, stays there, okay? So it's fixed to that position even if we scroll down or scroll up the page, okay? So that means a fixed position. You might uh, have seen some advertising in some web pages, okay, some squares uh, with advertising like that. So <coughs> this means uh, fixed position, and you now know how to to use it, okay. So okay, guys, this is all for this video. If you have um, any questions, just send me a message or type your questions in the comment section below. 
okay and I'll try to answer them as soon as possible and don't forget to subscribe and see you guys in the next video uh, which is a very important video and subject for in um, the XHTML world which is forms okay we're gonna start doing some forms in the next video okay um, it's a very cool subject and a very 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 um, used forms are very used in um, in XHTML and see you guys in the next video bye